So this lesson is called a VLOOKUP and a HLOOKUP. And the idea is that you should be able to research information from the table and have it appear up here based on whatever you type in. All right, so I'm going to color that slightly different so you can see where I'm typing. So if I go on here and press FX, I'm going to be using a VLOOKUP because I am looking up the information from a vertical table. Now, the value I want to look up is in A012. So this is the value I want to look up from this table below. The table array that I'm going for is this whole table, but do not highlight the headings, okay? Only the information. Now, I'm going for description this time. So that is in column number two. We've got item code in one, description in two, price in three, quantity in four. So we're going for column two. Now, if you want to make sure it is exact and it's correct, you type in false. Now, watch what happens. It's come up with baked beans. So if I change this to C967, it updates. And we're going to do the same with these now. So we're going for price, VLOOKUP. I want to look up this value. All right, let, be careful. So I want to look at this value from this table and it's price. So it's in column number three and again, false. All right, so you can see that milk is 99p and we're going to go again, VLOOKUP, lookup value from this in this table, column this time is four. And again, I want this to be false. All right, now watch what happens when I type in A023, changes to dog biscuit and uses all those price or B145. Now, the same works with this context. So I'm just going to type in West here, but this time we're using a H lookup and this does it from a horizontal table. So if I go to FX and I want H lookup, or you can search for it here. All right, so you can search. All right, I'm going to look up this value. Again, from the table, I need to highlight that without the headings, remember that, okay? The row number, I don't want the first row, I want the second. All right, so I want to match that. And again, I want false. All right, so now when I type this in, so I'm going to click OK. So we've gone, we're looking up J5 from this table and the row. I click OK. All right, you can see West. Now if I type in North, if I type in East, that updates and that's really useful particularly for anybody that needs to work with grades or with numbers maybe you're looking up a percentage from a table so that you can quote the grade um, that's a really useful tool to have in your toolbox when you are working on spreadsheets